What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course C and Puma wherever you may be. However you may be watching, thanks for making this video a part of your day. Here we are, Smackdown Live, doing our own interview because, well, Renee Young is nowhere to be found. But you can find this interview, www.com, youtube.com slash bigpumagaming, twitter.com slash cm underscore puma. Yeah, man. We're everywhere. Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, www.com. We're all over the world. Well, if you watched the previous video earlier today, episode 13, we had a submission match that was uh, challenged to us by Grand Metalik, Metallic, Metalik, whatever you want to call him. I thought, sure, we can do that. We got no problems. That damn submission match was against Chris Jericho. And I played that match. I rematched and rematched and rematched and restarted and did it over and over maybe seven eight times hour hour and a half and the the final one that you guys saw was me just being done that was so difficult and honestly i don't even know what my difficulty is for this it's normal it's on normal we'll move that shit to legend but the submission match jericho's submission attributes clearly way above mine and uh he could he could get us to tap out fairly quickly so i was done um after that match though we finally just gave up we failed the objective but it let us move on and triple h was out there ready to talk to us he said um you need to go find shane or daniel bryan shane being a company man Excuse me, Daniel Bryan being the fan favorite. Jericho, you pile of garbage. I've never been so upset. Now's not the time. Well, yeah, no shit. Now's not the time. Um, so being the company man that we are, hey, we went and talked to Shane, and Shane basically said, we need to find a tag team partner. Oh, I will punch you in the face. He pretty much said we need to find a tag team partner. So that is what we're going to do by talking to Todd. See if maybe we can find our own tag team partner. Anything I can do to help? No, nah, no, no thanks though. You best hit up some of these superstars. They're going to stir crazy as you. All right. So talk with a superstar you want to partner up with. So there's Jinder Mahal. Freaking Daniel Bryan. There's Chris Jericho, which I'm heated with Jericho. So we're not going to talk to him at all. Unless there's just nobody else. The lady's not there. Can we team up with the construction guy or the freaking garage guy? I'm so heated with that nonsense. I don't want to team with Dolph. Sorry, bruh. Let's see who's down here. We got Randy Orton and Baron Corbin really, really looking at what he's trying to do here. I think, you know what? Randy has told us before, if we want to make it in this business, where am I going? Then we need to listen to the authority and stay in line with them. Anybody in here? I think we're going to team up with Randy Orton just because he, he's, he seems to be company man that's the path we want to take um so let's go talk to randy orton sup <laughs> holy crap sup sup you and i are in the best of the roster i could learn a lot from you let me take you under my wing randy orton legend killer WWE superstar for 15 or 20 years, however long it's been. 15 years, probably. Let me take you under my wing. I'm going to say you and I are the best in the roster. I couldn't help realizing that both of us are the best the roster has to offer, Randy. And I need you on my team, and we can go to those tag team titles, brother. Well, you're half right. Where's this coming from all of a sudden? I have no beef with you or affection. Kind of nothing, honestly. I mean, you seem to be getting at something. What is it exactly that you want? I want you, Randy. I want you in and around my life. I, I want you in my heart. 
Come on. Yes, you. I just, yes. You and me in a duo together. Not an ambiguously gay duo. I'm talking about a tag team. We would make a legendary combination. RKO and the Puma Cutter. We got CM Puma and Randy Orton. We got Randy Puma. We got Porton. I don't know what our name would be. Yeah? And why would I want to do that with you? Face the... I can't do this without you. I'm not saying that. Face the truth. You need me. I feel like he would just laugh in my face and say, beat it. No one will be able to stop us seems like the logical choice here. Together, we would be unstoppable. No one would be able to defeat us. And we could hold those SmackDown championships longer than anyone ever. Even on Raw, New Day's reign, championship reign, squashed. We'll hold these titles for 2, 3, 5, 10, 15 years. You'll be an old-ass man, Randy, rolling down there in a wheelchair. You'll still have that tag team championship, though. Maybe. Aren't half bad yourself now and then. You claim no one could stop us. But last month, you got stopped pretty often, which is not true. You feel like a liability to me. Dead weight. I don't want you bringing me down. Act like you can handle having a superstar right next to you who is your equal or possibly your superior. Words aren't enough. Look, I'm good enough already. That shit with Jericho was something else. I won everything. That's exactly what I mean. You're getting nowhere in this conversation. We're done here. So, you're not going to be my friend? You're not going to be my partner? Talk with Todd? Man, oh man. Randy, that's just straight up hate. Hate, 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 hate. Baron, big Baron Corbin. That's what Big Red, Big Red and Y says, Big Calls and BBC. Big Baron Corbin. Nobody out in the parking lot. So speaking of Big Red NY, we have a uh, little bet going on with the Yankees and the Astros being in the postseason. The Yankees are up three games to two. Um, tomorrow on Friday, they come back to Houston for game six and seven if necessary. If the Astros win, Big Red NY has to wear a CM Puma shirt in five of his videos. If the Yankees win, CM Puma will cover up this glorious owl tattoo with a big train shirt for five videos we'll see what happens we'll see what happens there all right todd what you got for me apologies for the day we're ready now you good i'm ready at least nothing new there good luck out there uh what all right here we go if you missed it in the last video here is cm puma's entrance in his new gear you saw the red white and blue and all that but we've added a new shirt to our our attire look at that that paps blue ribbon son if you've watched any of my videos and heard me pop open a cold one crack a cold one with the boys you know it it's been paps blue ribbon because that is just my absolute favorite my absolute favorite all right let's uh let's skip this who, who are we facing here? Who are we facing here? Come on. Okay, it looks like one of the hype bros. Maybe Zack Ryder. I can't hear the music. I've got my thing down, my volume down. Oh, okay, it's Mojo. Skip this nonsense. We are about to put a beating on Mojo like no one has ever seen. Like no one has ever seen. And honestly, we just changed it to Legend, so actually, who knows what's going to happen. It's been on normal this whole time, and I I didn't know. So let's see. Let's see what happens with Mojo and Legend difficulty. Oh! Did we? No, oh, shoot. Hey, what are you, what are you Braun Strowman? Put me down. How about we touch on twice Can I roll out? Nope. Kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? Well, it looks like he's only got a handful of reversals, which is good. Shoot. What are you doing? Both these guys know that in this business, I am definitely not quick enough to just start throwing bombs. And he's going to get hooked up. Double arm DDT to mojo rowley come on brother can you think we can reach him from here no 
we can just flat out fail coming off the top rope. Uh-oh. Can we get out of this? We can. Thank goodness, man. He was close to those ropes. Shake it loose. Shake it loose, Puma. Hook this dude up. Brain buster. That's right. Now, we, um, as I mentioned in the previous video, we um, added a handful of moves, uh, new moves to... What are we doing here? Jeez, he moved. We added some new, new moves to CM Puma. We've uh, added some new taunts because we kept, for whatever reason, we kept doing the hurricane taunt. I don't know why. Get off of me. Um, we we've we got a new finisher, which is, I think is awesome. Um, it is a play on the old, oh, jeez, roll out. Roll out, Puma. Nope. It is a play on the old Puma cutter. Um, and honestly, I'm not even sure what it's called. So we're just calling it a, a lift up Puma cutter, lift toss up Puma cutter. I don't know. I need names. I need some names for moves, y'all. For reals, yo. And he reverses it, but it doesn't matter. Because, and I say that right as he just barrels over us. No. So this is a new move, a little jawbreaker. It looks, I think that's a jawbreaker. Come on, son. Come on. Come on, son. Oh. Get kicked. Bow. Now, one thing I will say about our son of a B, our match with Chris Jericho is that it, it, it was five stars. It was a five star match, and that was just flat out awesome that our very first match was, or, or that was our very first five star match. Oh, jeez. Big five-star frog splash. Just suck it, Mojo. Get up. Get up. Oh, okay. Is that what we're doing? Too late. Oh, my gosh. We barely got a chance. And it, it is nice to get a pin. It's nice to be pinned in the last two hours. I record these videos back-to-back, -back, so even though you guys don't see them, until you know they're five hours apart or so come on now get off me can i roll out thank you oh jeez. too late Ugh. come on now we can't let mojo blast us with a signature really dad gum never say never cole Oh! Does that does that restart the count? Cause that would be fantastic. It doesn't. It doesn't restart the count, by the way. Dang man, that whole shit with Jericho just got me rattled, bro. Okay. Get off me! Oh, that was his signature that we just told him to suck it on we're gonna charge up our finisher but we are going to use the carry system here big ass mojo rally see it says finisher uh oh shish get out that's all right that's all right dad gummit nope no sir no sir not today not today. Huh. Holy cow, we catch him. That's how an and an he's going to reverse us. Have Takes out the legs of CM Puma. Come on, fellas. Get it back into the ring here. And it right into the barricade. Well, he gets out of it. Right Whew. That's a pretty good move. And shoulder block, we're able to get out of our, get out of that silliness. Damn it, ref! It's gonna do some high flying nonsense. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. What? All right, I'm not gonna do any high flying nonsense because apparently we can't. Apparently we can't. Ah, Oh, I wasn't even paying that, paying attention. 
Well, hell, we just... Okay. That's a good match. And we have a new winning animation. As you can see here, I don't know how this affects uh, the breakout, actually, now that I think about it. Puma is crazy business. Let's, let's get moving here. All right, so we're going to go talk to the parking lot attendant. Apparently... I mean, did we miss out on something because Randy didn't want to be our partner? Ye boy. I've got to take off soon, but let's chat next week. Should we steal Mojo's tag team partner? I am not talking to you, Epico. Or Primo, or whoever you are. Let's go down here. Is Dolph still hanging out? Nope, Dolph is gone. Big E, though, staring at the soda machine. Rusev Machka. L Luke Harper. That guy. All right. So these guys aren't going to say anything productive if our task is to talk to the parking lot attendant. So let's go do that real quick. Come back and see if we can find a tag team partner. All right. Here we are in the second week. Let's go see. Let's go talk with Todd. Who's out here? Mojo. You going to get my car? Get my damn car, Mojo. Hope you've been training hard, my friend. Well, thanks for that insight. Hey, Lukey Dookie, what you got to say? Saw Mr. McMahon about before. Looks like he's got a lot on his mind. Oh, man, okay. I mean, our task is to talk with Todd, so I don't think anything will happen. But let's go hunting for a, uh, a person anyway, I guess. Nobody in catering. Rusev down there. Becky Lynch. Let's uh, actually let's take a peek in the locker room. There's nobody ever in this locker room. What you got to say, Rusev Machka? Your star may be rising, but don't let it ever get to that thick head of yours. No one man is bigger than WWE ever. The McMahon's are first and last name of wrestling. All right. I mean, is Vince just, like, sitting there with these people? Like, here, no, 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 no. Don't say that. I need you to say this. I need... Mm. Let's go see what Vince has to say. Look, I'm busy. Figure things out for yourself. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, let's fast forward over to Todd. All right, hold on. Look at the size of this dude. Is this the guy that Pulse created? Big trouble. Hey, fool. What you got on my 40? What the fuck does that mean? I hope you can and have... I, I hope you and I can have a match of our own soon. I'm ready to take you out. Bro, jeez. He was humongous. Who's in this locker room? Shinsuke. Let's see. What you got to say, my man? I'm in the middle of something here. Yeah, well... Me too. I gotta go talk to Todd. Anybody standing around the corner here? What you got for me, Todd? Can't let you out there. Vince wants to chat with you. Good or bad news? It's Vince. Could be either way. Better not keep him waiting. I was just in there. Son of a B. Who's in this? Who's in the authority locker room? Nobody. All right. Let's fast forward over to Vince. I heard you wanted to speak with me, Mr. McMahon. Randy Orton was mean to me. Nothing gets by me on my show. Okay, that doesn't sound fantastic. Quite frankly, I've heard you have been trying to recruit Randy Orton, and it hasn't been going so well. You know, you're right. Randy was being a dick, and um, I was just trying to tell him we were the best, and he didn't want to hear that. I, I, honestly, I think if I have a match against Randy and I beat him, you should make him my tag team partner. 
I like where your head's at. I truly do. But your execution is lacking. He's being stubborn. I can find someone else. Maybe I don't need a duo. He's being stubborn. He's a stubborn mule. This deal would benefit the both of us. Could you imagine seeing Puma and Randy Orton running roughshod all over SmackDown as the tag team champions? I should say it would. That's why I encourage it. At the moment, he doesn't see you as having any value. That's the real obstacle in your way. And if you want him to join your ranks, you need to show him how valuable you can be. I can't speak. I agree. I agree, Vince. Let, let's do this. Isn't my raw strength and ability enough? And if not, do I need to bash him over the head with a chair or put his ass through a table? Of course not. What superstar good enough to reach the WWE doesn't have that in surplus? Here's the thing about Randy Orton. He's currently in a... <laughs> He's currently in a rivalry with Mojo Rally. Show Randy Orton that you can take some weight off his shoulders by going at Mojo. I got you. The enemy of my enemy and things of that nature. Do that and your new ally will start to see the big picture. Thank you, McMahon. You are the almighty. Let's go hunt down Mojo Rawley and put a boot up his Zuba's wearing ass. Here you are. Nope. Where did I see him? Oh, in the parking lot. Look at the size of that dude. I saw him in the parking lot. Let's go to the parking lot where he's supposed to be getting my car. But instead, I'm going to whoop his monkey ass right here. Uh-huh. Oh. Right to the side of the face. Oh. I told you once. I done told you a thousand times, Mojo. You got a problem with Randy Orton. You got a problem with CM Puma. That's right. Backstage brawl, baby. Get up. Uh-oh. Oh, reversal. Right in front of the car. No. No, why can't I reverse? Um. Oh, we stopped him. And you eat that, you dummy. You doofus. Get up. Get up and eat this hard concrete. Oh, man. Oh, brain buster to Mojo. The man is going to be... He's got to be dead. And we're going to hook him up. DDT to Mojo. And you know what? I don't think I have a car finisher, so I don't think it's going to let me do one. It's going to let me do anything, for that matter. Ah! Uh, get punched. Okay, I see you. Too late, and we get dropped on the back of our head out here by the limo. And, dude, oh, I thought you were about to start a submission. You know how me and submissions are right now. Come on, Mojo, get off me, man. There we go. Nice reversal there from Puma. And eat this knee. That's, oh, man. Oh, boy, I see you. I see you out here. Uh. There we go. There we go. Oh, shish. Oh, man. Into the side of the car. You know, I don't take too kindly to that mojo. Eat it. I sure don't. Oh! He reversed us. And into the car we go. Jeez. Come on. Damn it. And now he's going to hit us with a finisher. Nothing we can do right now. Ooh. There's nowhere for us to roll out. Yeah, you know what, though? Just stand there. I appreciate that. That lets me get my reversal back up. And, you know, also makes you look like a total tool. So, yeah, I appreciate it. There we go. I mean, I guess. In, into the car. 
Man, what is Mojo doing here? Oh my goodness. Come on, man. Come on, brother. Brother. Oh, reversal. He's got his finisher. Too fast. Too late. Oh. Dude. That was intense. Leg drop from Mojo Rally. Oh, man. Too late on that one, that's for sure. Too late on that one, that's for sure. Shit. I'm having a hell of a time right now. Not a, and not a, in a good way, that's for sure. Look at this dude. Oh, what's with your face? Hey, Andre. Don't let me get in the way of your plans. I'm cheering you on. So we didn't... Uh... Hey, hold up. I think you inspired Jay Uso a bit. Don't get it? You will soon. Oh, man. Well, this freaking blows. I really wanted to do that tag team thing with Randy. That would have been fantastical. Nobody in the authority's office? Gary, my man, what's up, what's up? Anybody in the locker room? Aiden English? Charlotte. I'm sick of talking to Aiden. Hey, hey, hey. I'm still reeling from what you did last week. Mojo Rowley had blood in his eyes earlier. Okay. I guess. Alright, Todd. What you got for me, my brother? Hold up. Seeing Puma is already out there right now ambushing Mojo Rowley. Dude! Look. Looks like it's personal tonight. I'm going out there. I have plans. Normally, I'd, I'd look asconce. But since you got that aura of Vince planting an idea in your head, I'm going to look away instead. What the hell? I'm seeing Puma, Todd. Alright, Todd. Even though you said I'm already out there, here comes Mojo, so we're going to get a second chance. Oh, man. Second chance. Come on. Just let me come out and just wreck this dude. He is too hyped. Just for no damn reason at all. And we got Randy with us. Oh, man, oh, man. Here's our... Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, shit. Jey Uso. All right. Or, or here, I'll, I'll, I'll take care of Mojo if you want to take care of Jay. Holy cow. I did not see that coming. I mean, I guess I kind of knew it was coming. Because what Lana said, we inspired him. But man. All right. Let's do this, man. Randy Orton with that signature. Is he about to start stomping limbs? You know what we're about to do, though? Uh. Backstabber. That's right. There we go. There we go. Hang on a sec, Randy says. Yeah. Thanks for your help out there. Pretty cool of you. Not what I was expecting. I'm full of great surprises in the ring. Heck yeah, what can I say? Out there in the ring, I'm full of all kinds of great surprises. Makes me wonder what else you got hiding in your bag of tricks. Who knows? I'll catch you next week. But let's be partners. What's that? Who? Nothing. All right, man. Yeah, let's let... You say something? No? What? Okay. All right, yeah, we'll talk next... Yeah? What's that? What'd you say? What'd you say? You hungry? Let's grab some food, man. You know what? Let's go grab some food. Come on, Randy. Let's go eat, and then uh, we can drink some, some PBR. We're not going to talk to that jabroni. We're not going to talk to Shinsuke. Let's go eat, Randy. Come on, man. I think that's gonna that's gonna end it for this episode. That was an unfair double t screw you. I'll beat your monkey ass right now. That is gonna be it for this episode. Um, it turned out to be fairly decent, pretty good. Had a match against Mojo. We lost to him out here in the parking lot, unfortunately. But Randy and I took on Mojo and Jay Uso on the stage. 
and managed to win that. So that that's a pretty good video, I think, and a pretty good place to leave it. So that is going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not. And come back next week. Will Randy Orton be our tag team partner? Who knows? I'll see you soon.